So in the last two videos, we've been talking about delayed gratification, which starts out by putting off an immediate reward and pushing it till later, like saving your money till all of a sudden you've got $10,000 in the bank, as opposed to giving in immediately to the impulse to spend, having the reward immediately, but having nothing in the end. So we're going to apply that to uh, behavioral things, particularly with an addiction like pornography. Pornography satisfies immediately. You get that thrill, that rush, that high, that dopamine um, rush, but then it drops us down after, and the only way to get it again is to go back and look at more. And so the great writer, C.S. Lewis, has something to say about that, about how do we resist this temptation to get what we really want. So I'll read a little bit what he says. No man knows how bad he is until he has tried very hard to be good. Sometimes people think that good people do not really know what temptation means. That is an obvious lie. Only those who try to resist temptation know how strong it is. So we're talking right here when you're trying to hold off with the urge of the temptation, whatever your weakness is, in this case we're looking at pornography, you know how strong it is. He goes on to say, a man who gives into temptation after five minutes simply does not know how it would have been like an hour later. If you hold off and the urge has passed, an hour later, boy, you're getting some satisfaction. That is why bad people in one sense know very little about badness. They've lived a sheltered life by always giving in. We never find out the strength of an evil impulse inside us until we try to fight it. So my challenge is to you today, give yourself a minute, whatever it is, for me it's eating chocolate chips, uh, after dinner, just give yourself five minutes till that urge goes away. Go do something different, change your pace, and you'll find that you'll get stronger every time you resist.